Dr. Joseph Deturi, an ex-Navy diver and professor at the University of South Florida, spent a Guinness World Record 100 days submerged in a pressurized pod, 30 feet below the surface of the Atlantic Ocean, all in the name of science. When he emerged, tests on him produced jaw-dropping results. I'm 56 now, my extrinsic biological age was 44. When I got out of the water, my extrinsic age was 34, said Deturi. Here are five major changes he found contributing to his slowed aging and how you could reproduce his results without risking your life in a titan-like submersible. First, Joseph found that his telomeres, the caps that protect the ends of our chromosomes, became longer. As we age, the telomeres in our cells shorten. Short telomeres have been tied to immune system complications, degenerative diseases, and early death. While the relationship between telomere length and health and lifespan is not conclusive, longer telomeres have been associated with increased health and lifespan. This is why many anti-aging therapies aiming to elongate telomeres, such as TERT gene therapy, are being heavily studied. Don't forget to subscribe to hear more about cutting-edge longevity interventions and protocols. Several of Joseph's inflammation markers dropped by nearly 50%. Inflammation markers such as C-reactive protein, TNF-alpha and interleukin-6 increased with aging and elevated levels drive premature aging and are linked to age-related diseases and premature death. Researchers studying people that live beyond 100 years found that low inflammation is one of the best predictors of successful aging. This is why lowering inflammation, including through lifestyle and diet approaches, is one of the prime methods to age slow and healthy. Another finding was that Joseph's stem cell volume increased by 17 times. Stem cells are young cells that can turn into many types of cells, often replacing old and damaged cells and organs. And as you probably guessed, our stem cell numbers decline with aging, and lower numbers or their dysfunction is linked to many diseases. On the flip side, injection of stem cells has produced some astonishing results, including slowing disease progression and extending lifespan in mice. Joseph said his cholesterol levels lowered by over 70 points. High cholesterol, especially LDL cholesterol, has been strongly associated with atherosclerotic plaque formation, leading to risk of cardiovascular disease and premature death. While the current medical consensus shows that lowering cholesterol levels reduces cardiovascular disease risk, new research is showing that high LDL cholesterol may actually be overall beneficial in older individuals and those who are metabolically healthy. More context and research is needed to determine whether Joseph's cholesterol reduction was beneficial. Joseph claimed that he noticed two significant improvements related to his brain. He noticed an improvement in his cognition. Continuously working on boosting mental performance is critical to delaying age-related cognitive decline and associated diseases. He also noted improved REM or rapid eye movement sleep. Higher REM sleep is linked to better mental health and a stronger immune system. Joseph noted that many of these changes persisted for months after he emerged from the pod, showing that these beneficial effects can be long-lasting. Can these results be reproduced without living in a tin can in the middle of the ocean? Turns out, yes they can, possibly, with hyperbaric oxygen therapy or HBOT. Hyperbaric oxygen therapy is usually performed in special chambers where the person is exposed to increased oxygen levels and two to three times the atmospheric pressure. The therapy produces some outstanding health benefits, like Joseph observed, that are backed by credible scientific evidence. On top of it all, HBOT can speed up healing from injuries, burns, and infections, including COVID-19. And it could potentially improve physical performance and recovery no wonder many athletes swear by it. If you're interested, there are many private clinics offering HBOT therapy at a cost of roughly $250 per hour. If you want to see more emerging health and longevity therapies, then watch these videos.